Hazen Blue, San Antonio Marshall in white. And a bumbled pitch on the option there. Read option there, left side. And good for about five. It's a third and about six. Let's go! Let's go! And option coming this way. Got some room. Peach with a great tackle. Up ender. But it is good for a first, it looked like. So first down from the 28, 29. Shotgun. And there's that toss right. In turned him in, but got through him. 15 the other way, playing that safety. Tackles him, but he's good for about 10. First and 10 from the 18, call it. Motion left. Give this time. So this is the veer option. We've seen this before. Reading that first down lineman. And if he comes down, then he's pulling it. If he comes across, he's giving it. And Marshall splits two out wide this time. And there's motion. Toss side, strung out, good tackle low, and finished nicely. And that drops him for a couple loss. So third and 10, longest down and distance situation here for Marshall. And they've gone wide, this time motion, but then reverts back. And it's a give, nothing doing there, and it's fourth down. So fourth down, and I think if they don't get it, they'll restart back from the 40-yard line. Same formation, and they're going to fake everything. Roll to the right, try to throw it. The receiver wasn't looking, picked off there. That's Jaden Gingro, 27. It'll be a dead ball in the interception, but that Hayes defense bent a bit, but didn't break. So a 15 minute running clock is what each offense gets and then they'll switch. Run as many plays as they can. Set up at the 40, gonna throw this one all the way and connects that time on a stop route, the corner number eight with the tackle. So we're on the visitor side. Across the way there's the home but it's in full sunshine so nobody's over there. Not sure why the home side wasn't originally designed to be in the shade. Two has to read the end, and he makes a good pitch. 25 turns on the Jets and a good tackle there on the outside, but it's good for the first. We're experiencing a bit of a cool front right now. It's only 102. It's been 106 last about 10 days straight. A little bobble there. Five, that's Javi, disrupts things, and they're going to call him down. It would have been a fumble in a game. That ball was live and out. But number five, Javi, ferocious on both sides. Second and 10, strength to the near side. It's gonna be a hitch, high throw, and he missed him. And it was forward, so it was incomplete. Sometimes that hitch gets thrown backwards and it's live. So the little pistol look, wing back, coming this way, runs into traffic, tries to shovel it. And again, they call it dead upon delivery, knowing that it was going to be a fumble. So fourth and long. Fake the toss, roll to the naked side, going to dish it off to 10. Cohen's there and he never saw him. I was thinking if Cohen found the ball, he might could have made a play on it, but I don't think he saw it. And the turnover will reset him to the 40. There's a minute to go for the Marshall offense. Bang. So reset at the 40. 30 seconds left, so likely the last play here for Marshall. It's a fake up the middle as he reads it. Think about the option, he threw it late, but it was successful. And then knocked out by a host of blue jerseys. Quarterback paid for it, I think that was 19, that may be Lewis. Jarred him pretty good. Meanwhile, the red JV over here, cooking, scored three or four times already. It's a first play of offense for Hayes. Troy is the quarterback, and it's a give to, I believe, Peach's spot, and there he goes, looking for a little seam, found it on the outside, got through three, and picks up about 20. So one play, one first down, spot is the 20. And offense remains the same, 
Javi on the far side, Cohen on the near side to give to Javi, coming this way. Got a little room, got some speed, and tripped up and hits the deck at the one yard line, just shy of the line to make, in that case, the end zone, first and goal. Okay, look for Cohen's turn here. Let's see if they fake up the middle. Give to Cohen, there he goes. Cohen finds the end zone, no problem, he got hammered. But as he crossed, and so it counts. New running back on the far side in the wing back spot checks in. Troy is gonna throw a stop route and it's dropped by 17 who hammers the ground three times in frustration. So down number two. Troy gives to Peach, breaks free of the first tackle and the second and third, and still moving forward enough to gain 12 out of it. Looked busted at first, but the power of 16, I believe is what he's wearing, proves fruitful. First down on the 27. Troy fakes both, and then over the top, 43 almost had a hand on it. 15, the intended target. Cohen was running free down the boundary on the far side. Second down, if Troy goes the opposite direction, lowers a shoulder and levels a kid and rolls forward for, gosh, I bet half of what he needed. It looked like a busted play. Running back went to the left, Troy opened up to the right, so I had to make something out of it. Referee saying the Hayes quarterback is live. Figured everybody was live today. A little play action, dump over the top, caught by, I think maybe whoever was playing tight end up to trace it back to see where he was lined up at. Pretty cool matte gray helmets San Antonio Marshall's wearing. First down, can get a first before scoring. Hand off to 25 in the game at the left side wing back spot. Not sure what the Hayes offense calls that, I think. Fullback is directly behind the quarterback, and then you got a tailback and a halfback at left and right. Second down from the 12. And Troy's giving it to 19. Got a little room there. That's Lewis, I think, and then he's upended at the two. And that's how the former drive went as well when Javi got upended just before the goal line. Minute 18 to go for the Hayes offense. And so. If they score here, they may can line it back up and run one more play. Otherwise, they may just change it over if it takes more than one. Troy lines up under center, and it's a quarterback sneak, and he leans forward and stops short. How about that? Down to 30 seconds, and so this could be the last chance to pop one in for Hayes, and it is a dropped ball on the ground. And... San Antonio recovers it with 19 seconds. Hayes won't score a second time. First down was good for four up the middle for Marshall. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight in the box for Hayes. And quarterback's gonna keep it, got a seam. And hitting the gas, 15. Tomahawks at the ball, makes the tackle. So nothing wrong with 15's play there, saving a touchdown. So first and just outside what would be goal. Three's gonna toss it wide to 10. And turned in by number six. So after the big drop for loss, second and 15, maybe 16 from about the 18, maybe 17 here. And it's gonna be that throw, five. Now big stick there by Troy coming downhill from I think the safety spot, and they are good for only a couple. Third and long. Give up the middle, big A gap, and Troy finds him, but too late, and they score the third touchdown of the day for Marshall, who by my count, including the B team, which we did not film, uh, is up three to two. So reset, hit the 40. Long count, five comes in motion, wasn't ready for it, and they pitch it late, and they're gonna blow whistles dead. Haven't seen the veer option in a long time, so kind of a blast from my past here, watching Marshall run this O. 
Roll out to left, looking for the post across the middle. Troy misses him. In fact, Troy's limping. And it would have been a wide open score potentially, but the pass was dropped. Second and 10. And 55 in there in a hurry. Slings him to the turf like he's in charge. Third and 10 from the 40. Balance set here for the offense. Motion this side. And going to pitch to five. Javi, see if he can catch him. And gets enough of him to knock him out. Shy of the line to gain. It's a fourth and a yard. And 35 seconds to go in this segment. And 53 left early and they blow it dead. Good thing because two didn't have the snap. Okay. No yardage marked off. Fourth and a yard. Four seconds to go. This is the last play of this segment. And it's a rollout to the right. Throwing over the middle. 15 knocks it up in the air. Thought maybe he could tip it to himself, but it's a good one to end on, nevertheless, as ball would typically go over. Handoff, left side. Lewis snaking his way through, staying alive. Off to the races. They won't catch him. 19 to the house. I think that's Lewis. And that evens it up, except there's a flag, so we can't count it if it's against the offense, and usually these things are. Well, I don't know what the call was there. No call made, and of course, it would have come back to the 40 regardless, whether it was a score or a foul. 25 running with some authority there. Downhill he goes, and that's good for a first. Third in the yard. And going to throw it to the air and off the mark, looking for 15. First down from the 40. And handoff is to the back, directly behind QB, number 42. 450 in what's likely the last segment, second and seven call it from the 38-yard line. And give is to Cohen, and he's met in the backfield in a hurry. Nothing doing there. Third and ten. High snap over the head of quarterback. Dead ball. Whistles blow. So restarting the stick at down number one. Handoff to Lewis again. Lowers a shoulder, wins the battle, spins, still moving forward, 27. Jaden pushes him for another yard, and it's a manageable three yards to go. So second and three, 242 in the session, and 53 comes across, and the right guard reacts to it. Referee says, just reset, and let's go again. So Austin, looking for 15, put too much air on it, and five knocks it down. That ball should have been thrown on a line, and 20 would love to have it back and try again, I bet you. No splits, everybody in tight. And give to Javi, looking to do something with it on the left side, and there he goes, five spits out, they won't catch him. And hit the gas at the right time. High snap, ball on the ground, trying to get to Peach. And Hayes racing to the line to try to get one more play in as the clock gets under five seconds. And it's a give to Peach. And Peach, at the sound of the buzzer, stays alive, crosses away, and there goes Peach, and he's gone. And we hope to see more of that from him this year. 